Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel and today we are going to solve the Java problem regarding great calculator. So here we have to write a Java program that take an integer score between 0 and 100 as input from the user and the output as a grade based on this following criteria. So if the score is between 90 to 100, that means we have to print the message like grade A. If someone scored between 80 to 89, then we have to print the message like grade B. Similarly, if someone scored less than 60, that means we have to show like grade F. So this is the condition. Now we have to write the code. So if you see the criteria, right? What decision making statement you are going to use? You have multiple way, but the most simple way you can use the switch condition. So with the help of switch, you can easily solve the problem. So using switch, what you can do? First of all, take the input. And after that, whatever user enter the score, just divide by 10 and just create the case. Like if the case value you are getting as a 10 or 9, just print like it is a grade A. Similarly, if someone score 8 or I can say 80 to 89, that means we can easily print the grade B. So let's write the code, then you can easily understand. So first of all, we have to get input from the user. So how you can get? So let's use the scanner class. This scanner class is responsible to take input from the user. So just create the object and here try to pass system dot in. If you don't know how to do, then please watch this video. Now you have to import this class and this will come from Java dot util dot scanner. So you can see this is coming from this package Java dot util. Now let's print the message like interior score. 0 to 100 so we are showing message to the user like please enter this score now if you run what will be happen you can see we are showing the message but user cannot enter so we have to create a variable that is going to accept the input so how you can do so for that first of all we need to get the number and that number type will be what in so i can say in a score equal to a scanner Dot. So a scanner having so many things. So for our requirement, we need to get only integer. So what you can do, just use your next int. Now if you run, what will be happen? Here you can enter the score. Correct? You can see. But once you click the enter, automatically the program will be terminated. Because after line number 10, we are not doing anything. So let's try to use switch decision making statement. So here what you can do, just use your score divided by 10. If I enter 45 and when you are going to divide 45 by 10 in the integer, you will get the value as a 4. So if anyone will score less than 60, that means it's grade F. So we can easily tackle this one. So let's first of all handle about grade A and grade B. So just use like case 10, case 9. That means if someone is score from 90 to 100, we are going to consider as grade A. So now just use sys out and print the message like grid A. After that, once it's satisfied, then just use break and let's try to use default block also. So if someone will score less than 90, then for now let's print like grid F and let's try to break this one. Let's run. I will try to enter my score as 100. So you can see 100 means grade A. Now again if you run, I will try to enter my score as 56. That means what? Grade F. But if I will try to enter 85, you can see it is showing grade F. It has to show grade B. Why it is not showing? Because we have not considered a score of grade B. So what you can do? Just copy this one and put the case here as 8 and just say grade B. Similarly, let's try to create grade C and grade D. So let's try to check grade B. So I'm going to enter a score as 80. So you can see I am getting message like grade B. If I will rerun and if I will try to enter my score as 75, that means grade C. And again, if you run and if you try to enter the score as 68, that means grade B. So what are the cases we have entered? It is working fine. In case if you have a doubt, then what you can do? Just come and use here a score divided by 
10. So at least you will understand how the case 10 or 9 is coming. So if I will enter 86, that means here int score is now considering a score as 8. So once switch case will be started, now the case value will be what? 8. So that's why it is satisfying this one. If you have still doubt, then just put the breakpoint and run as debug mode. So it is showing message like enter your score. So I'm going to enter a score as 85. So now you can see a score as 85. Now if you either click on this green color or just press F8 in Windows system, it will come to line number 2L. Now you can put at line number 15, 18. So now if I press F8 or this green color, that means resume, you can see case value was 8. That's why it satisfies this line. You can see grade P. So I hope you understand this one. If you want, you can just use if else a statement or nested if else a statement. You can also tackle this kind of thing. But for this problem, switch is a very better solution. So see your next problem. Bye.